Hey guys, okay, just a few updates. My store, uh, thebestsauces.com or thebestjerky.net uh, to buy my sauces and beef jerky. We now have combo packs we started in the holidays. So if you wanna get just like a bag of jerky and a thing of sauce or a couple jars of sauce and some jerky, we've made combo packs for you because you guys requested that. And that's anywhere in the United States. The next thing we're working on on the store is allowing international people to order the beef jerky and we can ship it overseas. So that's coming. I'm just trying to work out logistics on whether it should be okay. We should be able to just put an envelope. The other thing is, uh, as a lot of you have found out, my app company has gone under. So my app is not working right now. I mean, it's working, but it's not gonna be updated or anything like that. It's not getting new information. So uh, what I'm recommending everybody do is just go to my website, cookingwithjack.com. Go register there, you can write me there, you can order sauce, you can order jerky, you can watch any of the shows. All my recipes are there, all my videos are there, it's all in one place now. So I don't have to deal with anybody else, I don't have to rely on anybody to stay in business. Uh, I can just keep doing videos and just getting them all up there. Now, you guys ready to get started? Let's do it. So here it is, Rubbermaid. Fresh Works, it's called Produce Saver. It says, keeps produce fresh up to 80% longer. Mm -hmm. But inside, they've got this little plastic bottom. See that? And that's to keep the produce up off the bottom, uh, away from moisture that collects on the bottom. Because when you get moisture, your produce starts to rot. Okay, if you look at the lid, right here there's a vent strip, and you can flip it over and see the other side right there. And that is to let airflow go through. Okay, here's the test. Fresh works, a banana with a paper towel to absorb moisture, which I've always practiced with. A banana just in a container with nothing. And then one in the refrigerator all by itself, inside nothing. Looks like we got enough to uh, do our little experiment, finish it off. All right, so there's the one that's just in the fridge with no protection. Just sitting in the fridge, okay? And this one is just in the container. They look, this one looks a little bit worse for wear. Starting to ripple, this one's still smooth. All right, so this one took just not much, but this I wouldn't eat, this I might still eat. It's gonna be really sweet though. Okay, now we did one that absorbs the moisture. We put a towel in a container with a banana, and that one looks like this. Didn't make a difference. In fact, this has a little bit more wear and tear on it. They were all pretty identical. And here is Rubbermaid Freshworks. I don't, 80% uh, longer. It's supposed to last 80% longer, and yet they all look pretty much the same. This, these two are alike, and this one is almost as bad as this one. It, it, it doesn't matter, it doesn't matter, there you go. Now I normally refrigerate my bananas because of fruit flies and bugs start to, you know, when they start to age like this. So now that we've shown that this doesn't make a difference, let's do this. Let's break out, add two more bananas that were out of the refrigerator. You guys curious to see what those look like? They were out of the refrigerator on the counter. Nobody ate them, so I thought I'd bring them into the video right now. These two bananas right here were out of the refrigerator. Now look what the refrigerator, the coldness does to the color. This has a better yellow, but you can see it has deeper bruising. See? So, I mean, you could leave them hanging out. So what I recommend is leave them hanging out until they start to show a little age, then throw them in the fridge, get a little more life out of them. But the main thing here is that Rubbermaid Freshworks is not worth the extra money. In my opinion, this is just one test. This isn't science, it's just a home test. So there you go, guys. I'll see you on the next episode.